Shooting up schools, hell yeah, let's go. What is going on, everyone? It is your favorite friendly neighborhood child molester. Uh, I can't keep opening my videos like that, that's really bad. But anyways, I'm back with the three rounds in every room challenge. And I actually got a request from a friend to keep on doing that because apparently it was entertaining even though it was a video I spent barely any effort on. But you know what? We're gonna put effort into this video at least so it can be somewhat mildly entertaining. All right. And today, I'm going to be playing a very interesting map for this three room challenge. And it is going to be... Drum roll, please. Actually, there's no need for a drum roll because it's gonna be in the title, isn't it? So, why the hell does it matter? I'm retarded, and I'm sorry. I'm just so retarded. It's gonna be Doris, though, because me likey Doris, and you know what? Fuck it. I probably will do, like, something like five later, but as of right now, I don't feel like hitting my desk because five is going to be extremely challenging, but three room, the three room challenge. Well, three rounds in every room challenge. I really don't know what to call it, but all right, here we are. Doris, well, I loaded in very fast. I just realized I loaded in very, very fast. And I do like that. We got to kill some zombies and survive three rounds in this starting room here. Yeah, I will probably, um, I'll probably cut to when, when this is done. I'm not sure, actually. Unless something interesting happens. I don't know. My Hitler youth knife. What the fuck did my guy just say? Okay, wait, no, that was interesting. He said something about Hitler. Yo, back when games actually weren't afraid to say the word Hitler. Actually, that's not true. I'm pretty sure Vanguard does say the word Hitler, but I think that's about it. Dude, this is a lot of blood. This actually doesn't even look like blood. What is this? Oh, what is that? That does not look like blood. Maybe like, I mean, this kind of looks like blood, but I don't know what the hell this is. That is, dude, that's a lot of fucking blood. What happened here? I only see two bodies. I mean, I guess two bodies can produce a lot of blood. I might have to test that on my school. I might have to like bring a gun to my school and test that. All right, gotta shoot this fucker. Get them points. You gotta get all of them points. You gotta, you gotta sound real excited about what you're recording. Doing challenges and zombies makes zombies fun. All right, zombies can be really boring because I like to go for high rounds. I like to go for round 100 and all that shit. I like to do Easter eggs, but when Easter eggs and high rounding doesn't sound fun, I go straight for challenges. I just do challenges and zombies, and they're fun. I feel like the surviving in a room for three round challenge is pretty fun in every room of the map. It's challenging and it's really, I mean, that's why it's called a challenge, you fucking dumb c But, that, it, it's really fun. It is quite fun. It is some of the best fun I have had in a while. Because games are becoming very stale. I find myself just doing random things rather than actually playing games. And even when I'm playing games, usually it's just COD Zombies or something. But even that can get stale sometimes. So, I am lucky that I am able to come up with this challenge. At least I think I'm the one that... I don't- I don't know if anyone's ever done the- this, like, this specific challenge. I mean, probably. I'm probably stealing credit, but you know what? I don't care. I don't care. By the way- Oh my god, I almost got double tapped there. By the way, this is the last round I have to stay in the spawn room, and then I can get out of here. That's quite pogger, I guess you could say. Oh! What you trying to do? You trying to sneak up on my- Trying to sneak up on my property? I'm an American! You can't infringe upon my rights, you fucking c- Alright. Oh, Hiroshima, that's actually gonna help me. I, cause I don't, I don't really worry. I'm not, I'm not, I can't speak. Holy Jesus. Now, should I count this as one room is the question. Um, uh, you know what? Yeah, I'm gonna count this as one room. I'm gonna, I'm gonna challenge myself and do this as one room. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go with that. That's probably a terrible idea. I probably should not be doing that, but you know what? It's a challenge for a reason, right? So, alright, you gotta utilize our grenades here, guys. You gotta utilize the grenade. Alright, I need this. I need you. I need you. Hopefully this thing can carry me, because if it does not carry me, then I could be looking at a very poor fate. But this is amazing. An insta-kill? Yeah, insta-kills are gonna be really good for this challenge. And, and Hiroshima's, I guess. Two more rounds here, and then we can get our boy the Thompson. Look at him. It looks beautiful. It's just chilling. But yeah, I gotta survive two more rounds and then, uh, then I think I'll be good. Wait, how- can I- okay, I mean, that's decent range, but it didn't really kill him, did it? That's the problem. My insta-kill also ran out, which is also a problem. Alright, you know what? We gotta, like, line up collaterals. Alright, that did not work. That did not work. Cancel the reload. 
for a player strats, you know what I'm saying? This is the, like the first time I've used the double barrel shotgun on Duris. I have never bought this shotgun before. I don't think I've ever, well maybe once, but like, I can't remember the last time I bought this shotgun. Imagine using the double barrel instead of just opening to the Thompson. Alright, this is getting bad. Okay, we got we got them collaterals lined up. We're pro players. Alright, a carpenter might be useful actually. Maybe. I highly doubt it, but we can make it work. I think we can make a carpenter work here. The carpenter is going to be useful for these barriers um, that I'm looking at. I feel like I should have counted this as one room because it says here automobile garage. And this also says automobile garage. I just feel like it'd make more sense. Eh, nah. I'm just going to count this as one room. I'm going to challenge myself here because it is a challenge so like why not challenge myself all right we gotta kill these zombies um, i don't want them to break the barrier because i kind of need this barrier to be up well i don't really need it to be up but i would prefer to have it up how did that zombie not die i point blanked his ass wow this shotgun is not the greatest i guessed i guessed dude i can't speak yeah this shotgun is um oh boy but you know what this is the last round i have to survive in so that's good news for me but you know what's bad news though? Is the fact that these zombies just broke in. Oh my god, that could have ended really badly. Alright, should I take this Hiroshima? Yeah, you know what? No, I'm gonna take it, I'm gonna take it, I'm gonna take it. Alright. Come on. There we go, let's go. Hang on. I'm gonna wait for this insta-kill. There we go, we go, we go, okay. Now luckily it's a dog round, so that allows me... Okay, I'm probably gonna trade out the my pistol here for the Thompson. The Thompson? Because the Thompson is a very good gun. A really good wall weapon. It's solid. It's a solid one wonder weapon. I was about to say wonder weapon. Bro, I can't talk. The Thompson is a solid wall weapon for the average player to take. I think I think the average player could make the Thompson work. Okay, that's not creepy at all. Yeah. World at War is not a creepy game. Totally, yeah. Yeah, this game is not creepy at all. Yeah. You know, with all the blood on the walls. Yeah, no, that's... That's perfectly normal. Oh, they have handprints too. That's totally normal. That's, that's um, that that's not concerning. All right, now I gotta survive till round nine, I believe, or something like that. I know I survived one dog round here, so just two more rounds, basically. But I can't count. I can't do math, so I don't. I don't know. I'm a little retarded, mummy. I'm a little retarded. Oh, here come the zombies. The zombies are trying to overrun me, but I'm better. Am I playing as a Nazi? I think I'm playing as an. I'm playing as Ricky Toffin, so. I think I'm playing as a, a Nazi. But you know what? I love Nazis. <laughs> do, 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 do. I'm rebuilding barriers like a fucking Mexican in a zombie game. Fuck yeah, my favorite. Alright, last round I'm gonna survive. Dude, I never noticed how fucking light this Dude, in the Black Ops 3 version, this room is a lot like darker. It's weird, actually. People consider World at War to be a creepier game, which it is, but, like, Black Ops 3 has a very, like, the lighting in Black Ops 3 is far more darker, I would, I would say. On the giant, yeah, the giant is way more darker than this map. This map is pretty, uh, you know, bright. Well, not bright, but, like, it's, it, you know, it's, it's, it's not dark. I would, like, the lighting is, it, I, 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 I can't talk. You know what? I'm not even gonna focus on talking on it. I gotta, like, focus up here, you know? Holy Jesus. Okay, this is king. Yeah, it'd be nice if I could get Jug. Like, really nice if I could get Jug. Alright, well, we got the Thompson, though, so... Thompson does work, man. Thompson will do the work on the zombies. Trust me, bro. Sources say Wikipedia, fam. We move on to our next room. Um, alright. What should I... Should I consider this one room and then th You know what? Yeah, I'm gonna... I'm gonna do that. I am... I'm... I am indeed going... Actually, you know what? Nah, no, I'm gonna consider all this one room. I, I, I feel like that's just too much for me. All right, you can call me a poo tang all you want, but I'm gonna consider this just this entire area just one room. You know what I'm saying? The box here. I don't even know where the box is actually. Actually, take the Type 100. I'm gonna need this. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. No. Holy shit, Dick. <laughs> it's rewind time. Literally, it's rewind time. We actually have to restart, so we have to rewind this. So, um, yeah, let me let me rewind this. Okay, attempt number two. Attempt number two. We got this. We got this. We got this. Wait, did I just jump over this? Can you jump over that? Wait, I never, I never realized this. Oh no, you can't. What the hell? And what the fuck did I do? I, I did something. I jumped over it. Here, come on. Let me do it again. See, I did it again. What the hell? You can jump over it, right? Kind of. 
Okay, no you can't. I'm being fucking scammed. We have to restart. And you know what? I'm gonna do better. I'm gonna not trap myself in that teleporter like area because I, I honestly did kind of trap myself there. Dude, these zombies could not be any slower. It's kind of a uh, kind of annoying. All right, I think I'm just gonna go AFK and then I'll wait for the zombies to come after me. So I'll be right back. I'm back. I'm still not dead. Are you fuck? Oh, hey, I came back just in time, though. Well, I could have died, but I didn't die. I was actually expecting myself to die there. Yo, where are you at, Zambi? Yeah. I'm gonna fuck your mom. I'm gonna fuck your dad. I'm gonna fuck every one of your family members, bitch. There we go. I'm stuck! What the fuck? I, I'm, I don't know what I was stuck on, but I was stuck. I was stuck like a stepsister. Okay, this is my last attempt. Yeah, this uh, second attempt is going to be my last attempt. Um, hopefully, you know what? I want to complete one of the maps. I really do. I reckon it's going to be challenging until, like... Because I want to do every single zombies map, you know? You, even including Cold War, maybe. Why not, right? Not Vanguard, though. Vanguard, I don't consider a zombies game. Vanguard is... Vanguard is worse than, like, fucking Extinction from Ghosts or something, you know? Alright, and also, I forgot to mention... I'm just going to count this, like one area as just one room this time just to make it easier on myself you can call me a poo tang but i just i really don't feel like um i don't feel like just dealing with the double barrel you know i'm gonna cheat a little bit i'm sorry i have to cheat i want that out you don't understand how tempting double points are okay i am a sucker for double points just as jason blundell is a sucker for medieval castles i'm a sucker for medieval castles <laughs> dude the, dude hip firing the thompson in this game is the most like, look at this look at this watch 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 uh -huh. It's just so satisfying. It's so satisfying hip firing the Thompson in this game. Sh sh shanking all the zombies. You know how we do it in Compton. I don't know why I'm speaking with a British accent when I'm talking about Compton. If anything, I should be talking like a black dude, but. Or like Snoop Dogg. I should be talking like Snoop Dogg. Dude, using the Type 100 is so satisfying. You have no idea. Oh boy. Alright, I'm getting a little. Dude, that was only the first round of surviving in this, like, entire room. So, I'm not looking forward to this, but I'm trying. I'm trying my best. Is this a good spot? No, I don't feel safe. Dude, I don't feel safe in this area. I really don't. You know what, actually? I Hang on. I'm gonna have to end the round. Oh, I want that max ammo. No. Please, let me have the max. Ah! I don't know what that noise was that I just made, but it was a weird one. Alright, throw a grenade. Throw a grenade just in case, you know. No! Okay, um... You know what? I may I may have screwed up here. I have to circle around. Okay, I can't circle around. Um, I'm gonna cut this out of the video. Yeah, I, th I think I'm gonna cut it out of the video. Why not, right? You know? I can cut this out of the video. No one will notice. Alright, so we're... We totally didn't fall off here. Alright, we totally didn't fall off there. That did not happen. Okay, I don't know what you're talking about. Listen, man, I wasn't going to restart, okay? I was not going to restart. Too much effort. There's too much effort in restarting. You know what? The, the rules are... I mean, the challenge is called sur survive through rounds in every room, but you know what? I never said I couldn't just leave the room and, you know, do other things while I keep the last zombie alive so I don't end the round, right? So, yeah, you can't do shit about it, can you? Because I'm, I'm the one who's doing the challenge. Yeah, I'm the one who's doing the challenge, not you. So you can't, you can't talk shit. Alright, well, I'm gonna kill that last zombie, and then I just gotta survive one more round in this area. And then I'm done with this area. I don't like this room, by the way. Yeah, so the rules for this challenge are a bit scuffed, because uh, I, I haven't really dug much into it. But I plan on clarifying the rules more as time progresses. You know, I, I really do want to establish some good ground rules for this challenge, but I also don't want to make it too easy of a challenge. But I also don't want to make it too hard, because the one I did on Kino, it was impossible without a ray gun. It really was. So I want to try to make it possible, but at the same time, still very difficult. I need to try to find, like, a fine line between the two difficulties there, which is what I plan on doing in the future for this challenge. You know, what should I do? Should I go this direction and survive in this area, or should I go this direction? The box is down there, but Jug is over there. 
Okay, you know what? I say jug. I say jug. I, I have to like make my decision now. I'm gonna count like this entire area. I don't feel like I should be counting this. Like this area is way too small to survive in. I, I'm sure. I'm sure everyone can agree on that. So it's gonna be this entire area here, and then that jug area too as well. But I think I'm just gonna be staying down here for the meantime. Dude, yeah, Im imagine surviving three rounds in that area. Yeah, that's impossible without like a ray gun or. Uh, I mean, even the Wonder Waff really wouldn't help you that much. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, you know, not make it impossible. As I said, I want to try to find a fine line between the two. Die a bunch of. Oh, insta kill makes it very easy. All right, so I survived a dog round in here, and I just this is my second round in here. I mean, the Nazis were kind of justified though, right? Dude, where the hell did that come from? I don't. Some of the fucking shit I say. Oh my god. Like I might have to cut so much out. But at the same time, at the same time, I want to leave it in. Okay, we're good. Dude, I'm kind of getting scared. Yes, that is gonna. That is huge. That is huge. That is huge. That is huge. I am so lucky. That is huge. That is huge plays. Huge plays. Insta kills are huge plays in this challenge. You know what? Yes, I want the MP40 actually. The MP40 is awesome in this game. No, no, okay, 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 that, that could have been really bad. That could have been really bad. Yeah, this MP40 is slapping. It's better than the Thompson, I would say. Is it? Actually, I don't know. Is it? Hang on. I, I, I really... It's hard to... Maybe they're just the same. I'm willing to bet that they're probably just the same. But I don't know. Alright, I think we're approaching the end of the round here, luckily. Are we approaching the end of the round? I can't tell. There's a lot of zombies still. Now, I'm gonna do something here. I'm actually gonna allow myself to access, like, Pack-a-Punch. You can call me a cheater if you want. I call it an alternate method of playing the game. But I do want to have, like, at least something come at me. Now, I will not spin the box there. Because I do think spinning the box is a bit too much. And buying the STG here, I also don't think should be allowed. Alright, you can do it your own way if you want. But this is my way. Alright. I never claim to be good at the game. So that's what I'm doing. You got a problem with it. Well, then that's just too bad. Alright, and now we go back. Now, you can call me a cheater. But I call it fair, alright? I feel like going the entire game, because in that Kino video I made, I literally could not get Pack-a-Punch, which is just too much. I feel like you should be able to get Pack-a-Punch, so yeah, that's what I did to myself. I'm just gonna make it easier this time. I, I really do want to complete at least one map, you know? Also, this is a dog round, so... I do like dog rounds here. They make it... They make uh, these rooms go by a bit faster. That's very sad. If you guys don't know the story behind this dog, this dog was basically a little girl's puppy that was pregnant. Well, not a puppy. It was a dog that was... Imagine if it... Was it a puppy? I don't know. But it was a pregnant dog and it got it got teleported on accident. You know, in one of these, you know, teleporters you see in this game. And it became that. So, yeah, it's, it's really sad. It's genuinely a really... A very sad, uh backstory to the dog and the dog gave birth to more dude this is satisfying just gunning all the all these zombies down with an mp40 it's quite satisfying there it is we have survived officially for quite some time in this area and now we have to move to the speed cola area which is over here we are so this is all one big area over here too just one big area but it's not very a really viable training area though that's a bit of a problem yeah this is a very tight area very claustrophobic yeah this isn't very viable training spot wait what's the name of this 420 impaler oh you know i just realized these two rooms actually connect the power room and you know what? i'm gonna count the power room as its own thing and then yeah i'm gonna count the power room as its own thing i feel like i'm playing Shang shangri la it's so claustrophobic insta kills are amazing in this challenge genuinely my favorite drop better than a max ammo Ooh, and a double points the holy duo a double points with an insta kill now that is a sight to see i'm gonna activate this trap here this is gonna be the strategy actually whenever i can i'm gonna rebuild this barrier Shoot the zombies here. Yeah, I think this could work as long as that trap is active. But if the trap is not active, I'm gonna have to, like, you know, circle back or something. Alright, my MP40 is running low on ammo. Alright, I gotta bail. I gotta bail out of there. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm red screened. Oh no. Okay. Relaxing end, please. Oh! 
Okay, there we go. Okay, so now we move to the power room. Now, I'm gonna count this, like, one area here as... But then I'm gonna count that teleporter room as its own thing. Dude, why are dogs so strong in World at War and Black Ops 1? Like, look at that. Take so many bullets. And this is a pack-a-punch weapon, may I remind you. Um, I really want a... Ooh, that's good. That is good. I really want a wonder weapon here, though. Well, I have the trap here at my disposal, so I could just use the trap. Do the HK. I love the HK. I mean, who doesn't love the HK? The HK with double tap, genuinely an amazing, an amazing, like, combo. Oh my god. They're hitting me a lot. They're hitting me like I'm a woman. I don't blame them, though. Now we're out of this area, and now we move on to this area. This teleporter room. And I think this is the last room. So, yeah, the video is coming to an end here. And my life may as well be coming to an end here as well, because I'm not sure if I can survive very long here. I mean, yeah, I can. This is a good training spot. I just don't train here often. Is that insta-kill? No. Wait, yes it is. <gasps> yes it is! Yes it is! Yeah, fuck you! I'm gonna kill all of you. It's genuinely so useful. Thank you for the insta-kill, God. Much appreciated. Now, I'm gonna do some relaxing end strategies here, and... Save the max ammo for when I throw my next monkey bomb. Now, yeah, that monkey bomb is not going to do much, though. But that insta-kill is going to do a lot. Yes! Dude, these insta-kills. They're genuinely clutch. I love these insta-kills. Me and all my homies love instant kills, as they say. Speed run. Kill them all. Don't let any of them live. Purge them. Purge them like, um... Purge them like the, the Mormons... Purged and raped the Indians. Wait, did they? I don't. I don't actually know. I. I don't know a lot about history. I, did they do that? I. I. Don't, I don't know. I could be wrong there. One more round. We gotta survive round twenty-four, and then we're out of here. We are done with this challenge for Doris. And it's a dog round. That's convenient. That is very convenient. You know what? I'm gonna. I'm. I'm so cocky. I'm just gonna throw all my monkey bombs. I'm gonna sit here. Oh my god! He did some kind of weird jump there. What the hell? Is this the last dog? Please be the last dog. Yes. Yes. Yes, dude. Doris. We're done with Doris. I think that was every room. I have survived three rounds in every room. Ooh, you know what? Here's the celebration, boys. Here's the celebration. You know what I'm gonna do. You know what I'm gonna do. You already know what I'm gonna do. Hell yes. Hell yes. This is what we call... What is it called? Armageddon? Really? Armageddon, huh? This thing is probably terrible. Yeah, this thing is awful. Revive me, bro. I have car 98k. Alright, yeah. This thing is fucking dog shit. It's just so sad. Look at this. Is this how school shooters feel? Is that how school shooters feel? I feel like that's how school shooters... Maybe school shootings aren't so bad. Alright, I missed. I'm terrible. Holy Jesus Christ, it's okay. I'm I'm better. I'm built different. Oh no I'm not. Well Hey, I did I did every room. So you know I'm not complaining. Take me. Take me. Take me to the heavens. And that was the three rounds in every room challenge for Doris. At least I think. Maybe I'm missing room. I just it doesn't feel right. I actually accomplished something in my life. That just doesn't feel right. Oh, no, I don't want to restart. No, no, that's not what we want. All right, well, that was three rounds in every room for Doris. That, that actually wasn't too bad. The only time that I really got intense was near the speed cola room, I would say. If you need a good way to make zombies fun, if you're bored, that's a good way of making it fun. Well, I'm going to go now. Um, I'm probably going to go pack up an AR-15 and head to my local elementary school.